As a kid, I grew up playing games on Newgrounds and other random obscure Flash games, and at this point anything which reminds me of this point in my life gives me insane nostalgia, and an artist who captures this nostalgic feel better than no other in my opinion is Yabujin. Yabujin is a 23 year old rapper and producer from Lithuania, who started making music in 2016, with his first song being one called Gal Games. Throughout his career he has gone by various names, but one thing has remained constant throughout Yabujin's music, and that's the nostalgic feel he manages to capture in each song. Yabujin's music consists of heavily bit crushed and sped up vocals, an otherworldly production, which is unlike any other I've heard. His songs sample practically anything, with songs having anything from Memphis rap samples, to berserk samples, to even dating simulator samples, with the aesthetics of his work being mainly focused on internet culture from the early 2000s. And visuals and lyrics that reference video games that came out around that time, like Love Hina Sim Day RPG, Tekken, Counter-Strike 1.6, RuneScape, and various online Flash games. Yabujin's cover arts are really cool as well, ranging from screenshots from obscure dating simulator Flash games, to weirdly familiar images, a foreign internet aesthetic, and Yabujin even having a project called Swords, which has guts from Berserk on the cover, with the project even sampling the 90s anime. I'm fairly certain he makes all of his cover arts as well too, because Yabujin has been known to draw cartoons in his past. I think this level of creativity is really respectable, and it's clear he has a good ability to match that feeling his songs give with good fitting cover arts. Under the name Yabujin, he has put out five projects, Swords, Baroque, Flash Desire, She Likes Swords and Doing Drugs 1, and Fezome. However, as of right now, Yabujin isn't putting out music, and at the start of 2021 Yabujin took a hiatus, wiping his entire SoundCloud clean and he started to solely make music under his alter ego, DJ Garota Zhao. Recently though, Yabujin came back to Instagram, so some people speculate whether or not he may come back. Overall, if you haven't checked out Yabujin's music, I definitely recommend you give it a listen and see if you like it. I recommend if you're new to his music to listen to his projects, Swords or Flash Desire. I hope you enjoyed the video, and that you have a good day.